From your, your voice, you know, say a big. <laughs> Yo, trends here, you know what I mean? Um, back at it. I've, I, the last video that I made in regards to my journey in becoming a full time day trader was in the middle of September. And anybody been following my TikTok, even my YouTube, I do have videos posting showing a bit of my journey. Um, I have more of the content to come up. However, this video is about my journey in becoming a full time day trader. And in doing so currently, uh, I said I'm going to show you week over week what's happening, what's going on. But for the last two weeks, I've been traveling a lot. I've been in Vancouver, I've been in Winnipeg. You know, I haven't been home much, right? Um, so now I'm home and I'm going to keep you updated with what's going on. And today's a significant day, September 30. You know what I mean? At the last of September, you know, September, my month. And anybody in the trading world knows that September is a month for opportunity. Most stocks fall, drop, dwindle down in a September. That means opportunity. Because when a stock drop, even if you're in the stock and the stock will fall, it's a good time to average down, right? If it's a good stock. This is not financial advice, right? Anything you're doing, make sure you do your, in, 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 your, 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 your research and do your due diligence so you can make your decision in any trade you're taking, right? The stock that I was looking at in my last video was HYSR. Right, the company currently is still averaging about two cents. The reason why I was looking into that company is because I am even close to becoming a full time day trader. As I stated before, in becoming a full time day trader, the quarter the requirement is to have 25k in your US brokerage account, right? So you can do any amount of trading within a day. Currently, I'm only able to make three day trades within a five day span. Doing more than that will have my accounts on restriction and stuff like that, right? So it's really hampering for me. Even when I see the market going some type of way and I want to capitalize, I want to go in and out, I can't. So with that being said, uh, HYSR is still below $3. I bought it just below 3 However, that stock, has the way it has been set up year to date, it has not fall below a dollar and it's run over three dollars in the in six months in a six month span like three four times right and it, it makes higher high but currently it's not made it's not gone above the last high which is about four cents and something right uh i'll put it up here on the screen where it is currently it closed at september 30. i still have quite a bit of share in it and um i'm banking on that too because guess what with penny stock, it gives you the ability to either you, you gain massive or you lose massive. It's a risk you have to take, right? I also have share in uh, NVIDIA, right? But it's, it's just a few shares, it's not a lot, you get me? So I can't be banking on that even though NVIDIA is providing massive opportunity. And this is the thing with the stock market, it takes money to make money. You go in the stock market with 100 and 200 or $500, and you try to make some money you're not going to really see it unless you're trading like penny stock if you can take 500 dollars and put in a penny stock that costs a, a cent then and the, and that stock runs to 10 cent run to 10 cent then you can make some money but outside of that like you're putting yourself in in more of a risk in doing so you know so i'd advise somebody who's starting like if you don't have somebody tutoring you if you don't um know much about the market you know what I mean? You go, just know so you have a, you have a PF for learn. <laughs> you get me? However, you have good blue chip stock out there where you can invest in. Like, that's why I have uh, shares in NVIDIA. I also have some shares in GameStop, which that is a meme stock. Anybody are coming at the stock market or know about the stock market, know about GameStop. So we don't have to say nothing about that. You get me? But yeah, my accounts currently, what I plan on doing for this month of October, I just freed up, sell some shares in the loss. Oh, uh, L. However, um, not because um, you, you take an L doesn't mean that you're going to, you know, not win the war, you know what I mean? So, here we go on. I'm going to sell some shares and I'm going to clear up about almost $800 in my account. So, for the month of October starting tomorrow, I'm going to have $800 for trade with. So, what I'm going to do is, on my graph right here, I'll be, I'll be, uh, Updating that graph sheet to show you all the buy and sell within uh, the month of October and where I end within the month of October as well with that $800. I'm just going to play with it.
play with it not for any long swing trade if it if i gain within the day i take if it's a l i'll take but day trade with that 800 dollars and i'm gonna see where i can end by the end of october you know so that's a challenge for me so this is 800 dollar challenge for day trade for the month of october that's gonna be um be my goal with that 800 dollars that i had cleared up today so yeah um i'll keep you all updated week over week like i said um i don't have anywhere really going in october not that i am aware of currently so it's gonna be a bit lighter easier for me to make a video you know i still do tiktok i still uh trade and i still have my continental shift i work 12 hour shift morning the nights my my goal and my dream is always to be a full-time day trader so um putting in this type of work even though i'm working them type of shift i'm um, have all different type of stuff going on is like it's it, it it's worth it for me you know because at the end of the day i know what i'm aim for i know what i want you know what i mean and i know what it does when you actually accomplish it because watching the success story of all of these great persons that i admire how they go about it you know these younger person younger adults how they became successful at a younger age i personally never have the opportunity to even be in this position two years ago so i'm grateful you get me so everything take time in our life you know i'm not rushing you know what i mean i'm happy i'm grateful and i just want y'all to keep watching my youtube like comment share tell a friend you know what i mean help build my platform help me grow and me i got me gonna know everything we have wanted me and if i can motivate you or i can say something that inspire you to do something for better yourself that bring joy to me just leave it in the comments see me as you but yeah, like you can look in, my, in the description below, you see my TikTok angle, you see my Instagram, uh, probably my snap they don't there. Look in at the link below, the description below, you see some link or, and some names. You can follow me on all of my, all of my, um, my social media websites and uh, yeah, just check me out and you see the journey, you see what I do day to day and how I go about life, but yeah. <laughs> You know, it's trends, so I'll keep you all posted. Thanks for watching. Remember, leave a like and drop a comment. You know what I mean? Or leave a comment and drop a like. You know, get it. We get it. We, we get. We get used to this YouTube and nah stop. Y'all know me. Y'all know so I'm some nah stop. Nah stop. Send don't stop in the comment. If you reach this far in the video, comment don't stop. <laughs> hey it's monroe from team trang subscribe and like all the content and follow below hi guys team trang's baby mother here my beg you know, go over my youtube page run go over there go like subscribe and leave a comment all right one bumble clap baby mother remember that hey everyone this is mimi um from tiktok representing team trang's join his youtube channel trang's dot like subscribe and join the team. Cheers. What's up, guys? My name is Rena, also known as Call Me Rena on TikTok, and you're watching Trunks' YouTube channel. Subscribe to join the community and have a little fun. Hey, this is OJ, representing for Trends, my brother. Go like his channel, go subscribe, and go leave a comment. Hey, Steph here from Team Trends. Keep watching his YouTube channel for more great content. Like and subscribe below. Hey guys, this is Curls XO representing her team chat. Go check out his YouTube channel, like and subscribe. Widow Queen here from Team Tranks. Just want to say, check out his YouTube page. Come join the party.